best car upholstery cleaner. Hey guys and girls, welcome to yet another video. What if I told you to literally throw out the best car upholstery cleaner, whatever that means to you. You decided that your car interior was dirty and now you need to clean it. And now you want to make it cleaner because you want a cleaner interior versus a dirtier interior. And you go online in search of the best car upholstery cleaner car upholstery shampoo, call it whatever you want. What if I told you just to take it and throw it out the window because you have one of the best cleaners, the most prolific in nature cleaner that actually exists and that's what's called water. Yes, that is one of my hacks. Now the purpose of this video is to, for one, demystify one of the endless areas of car care that is so hyped up and embellished with BS, misrepresentation, uh, glorified terminology, and I believe that a lot of you are overwhelmed by the endless choices that you have when it comes simply to sprucing up the inside of your car, shampooing the floor mats, cleaning the vinyl upholstery, cleaning the leather upholstery, when in fact right in your own house somewhere you have access to water and a cloth. So this is a brand new microfiber cloth. I have gotten it wet so it is damp. I have wrung it out so it's not dripping wet. If you just took this cloth with regular water on it and you proceeded to wipe down the interior of your car, I think you will be one, if not both things, completely shocked as to how much dirt comes off on a rag with nothing but water on it. And secondly, amazed at like, wow, you mean I can get these kinds of results with nothing but a cloth and tap water out of my own house that everyone virtually has access to? It's like, oh my gosh, talk about a voice of reason. So here I am not trying to sell you on a particular car upholstery cleaner. I'm not trying to push a particular brand of car upholstery cleaner down your throat. I'm saying like, hey, guess what? This industry is filled with so much hype and BS. I get it. A lot of you are likely overwhelmed to the point of inaction. I want you to take action and get results that are welcomed into your life. This is a simple way, a simple hack, a simple trick to get the results that you want in your life. So. While you're both perplexed and amazed and dumbfounded and disturbed, whatever, whatever label you want to use by this moment, hopefully the next thing will be this. Oh my gosh, if I can accomplish this with a simple cloth and water, what could I possibly accomplish in my car by my own doing if I actually found a quality car upholstery cleaner? I actually employed the use of a good quality scrub brush. And I did use a microfiber cloth. And now I went in there and I pre-vacuumed. I vacuumed up the loose debris first. I sprayed a light misting of some Best Car Upholstery Cleaner. And I scrubbed it and I mopped it up. And it's like, oh my gosh, honey, check this out. Look what I did. I was able to clean the seat of our filthy car and it was not that hard. But this, for years I've been overwhelmed by the industry and I see all these opinions floating around of what to use, what not to use, what to do, what don't to do, all these horror stories because the internet is filled with horror stories and they make for good headlines. But yet there you sit perplexed and overwhelmed by anxiety and fear and trepidation. It's like, oh my gosh, I don't know what to do. Well, that's where I want to be a voice of reason. I want to get you off the fence doing something that you will be surprised and perhaps disturbed by, perhaps simultaneously, but then more importantly, get you to actually take some action. So with that said is always check the links below the video. There's always going to be a link that'll take you to my website and I will go into great detail as to the types of cleaners that I recommend that are efficient, effective, and safe to shampoo and clean the interior, your car upholstery, call it whatever you want. So with that said is leave me a comment. By all means, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel, whatever floats your boat. 
But more importantly, I want to hear a comment from you. It's like, Darren, you're so right. I've been overwhelmed by this industry. I can't believe how much hype and BS is in there. And it's gotten to me to the point where I just didn't want to do anything. I just threw my hands up and gave up. But in the meantime, I'm driving this dirty ass car around. It's driving me crazy. It's sending my blood pressure even higher than it already is. And I want to do something about it, but I didn't know where to start. Well, now you have an answer. And now you realize, oh my gosh, there is an answer to at least get me started. So leave me those comments and by all means, tune into the next video. And until then, we will see you on the other side.